Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Barry and this is Central Eyes and I've been tagged. And this is four fragrances that describe earth, wind, fire and water. So I was kindly tagged by Claire over at Smurfy Girly. I was also inadvertently tagged by Lizzie from Rose and Jones. And this is four fragrances that describe fire, which is the first one I'm going to do, earth, water and air. So we kick straight into the people I'm going to tag. And the first person I'm going to tag is the fragrance wardrobe. He used to be called Dapper on a Dime. You might have seen him in one of my previous videos. But unfortunately he's been hacked and his YouTube channel was deleted. So he's had to start again. So if you could give him a bit of support, that would be brilliant. But you're tagged, mate. Second person I'm going to tag is Darren over at The Fragrance Don. Love Darren's channel and it'd be great if you could do this tag. And the last person I'm going to tag is Mia over at Fab Trends Mia. She is fabulous, love her channel as well, always in her lives, got a great personality and I'd love it if you could do this tag as well. So the first element I'm going to do is fire, as you can see behind me. And there was only really one fragrance which I could pick to do this. Um, and it has to be by the fireplace by Mason Margiela. So this is absolutely amazing. It is like being by a fire, but you've got the added bits of chestnuts, which you normally roast over an open fire. Um, it's got like a vanilla in it, which gives you that same feeling as if you're roasting marshmallows. It's absolutely amazing. It's got lovely woods in it, as you would expect, because that's what's burning on the fire. It's got cloves, it's got pepper, it's got Peru balsam. It's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Some people don't like the opening, and the opening can be a little harsh, but once the sweetness from the vanilla and that kicks in, it's absolutely to die for. I love it, absolutely love it. I had the Discovery set, and this is the one that I picked to buy out of the Discovery set. There's a couple more I still want to get, but this is the one that I picked. So that is fire. So the next element was air. Now for me, air, the only one I could think of, I mean there was a couple which I'd got which had got aldehydes in it, which I quite enjoy, but I think this is the one that stood out for me. And it's um, a new company, it's Air by Tessa Williams. This is one of the brightest openings I have ever had in a fragrance. It's got lemongrass, it's got lemon, it's got grapefruit, it's got ginger. It's an absolute powerhouse up front of citruses and freshness. And it does give you that airy feeling, it's really beautiful. It's also got hints of coriander in there as well and other spices and it does put you on a Caribbean beach. It's beautiful, it really is nice and that's air. So the next one and this is C. Now what could I pick for C? Well the only real one you could pick is Nautica Voyage. This is amazing it's got the C notes in there which everybody loves but it's got like um, apple it's got green leaves but it gives off like a real strong cucumber feel to it which I absolutely adore really enjoy there are some lovely floral notes in this as well like mimosa which is absolutely lovely and then it's got musks in there as well but it just gives you that feeling as if you're by the seaside it absolutely does it's beautiful so that is my C pick. So the last element was earth. What better way to show off earth than to have a bean 
growing in the soil um, in a time lapse. And my pick for earth was Tear de Hermes. This is the EDT, but it could quite easily have been the Vetifa version or even the Parfum version. Now this has got like a, a described as a dirty orange smell, but it's more of an earthy orange. And then with the vetiva and the spices that are in there, this reminds me of being outside. It's an absolutely beautiful smell. I love it, absolutely love it. There's woods in it, there's all sorts in there. It really is nice. And that is Tear de Hermes, the EDT. So what would your four picks be? Leave a note in the comments below. Don't forget to give me a like, it's always helpful, and subscribing. We're getting closer and closer to the 1000 mark. Hopefully be able to hit it soon. Um, all that's left me to do is to say goodbye to everybody and stay fragrant, not vagrant. <laughs>